what's up loves thank you for coming back to my channel and look at this disaster i have to clean up i mean a hot mess so yeah let's just begin I also want to apologize because I was supposed to post this video back in October. So yeah, Halloween decor it is. I'm going to start with the kitchen and wash the dishes, load the dishwasher. Adorable Frida cup that I want to show you. So yeah, I'm just gonna load up the dishwasher and um, if you are new to my channel, please subscribe and like. I am new to YouTube, so I would appreciate all the love I can get. I'm just gonna refill my container with some dishwashing liquid. I just like how this container looks more, it's prettier. And it's Dawn, by the way. I prefer Method, but my mom likes to use Dawn. And she's been staying with me, so yeah. It's her way or the highway, I guess. She wins. Eventually, I ended up replacing this sponge thingy because it just, it kept getting all over the place and it aggravated me, so. So right now, I'm just kind of washing off all my plastic cups and things like that because I don't like to put those things in the dishwasher, so I just hand wash all those things. And I love my brush with the suds, the little suds maker. Um, I got it off of Amazon, to be honest with you, but I see that a lot of people are getting it off of the Grove. I am not with the Grove, but um, I heard they're actually really good, so check them out. I'm just gonna place down this dryer rack. I actually ended up replacing this for a dish rack that I went and bought. But again, I am sorry for taking so long to post. It's just been um, a really long holiday. And I usually host most of the holidays and I host it Thanksgiving and Christmas. So, and it went by so quickly guys. Um, as you know, I have like shelves in my dining room right now. Um, if you haven't seen it, go look at my other video where i put a diy on how to get some farmhouse shelves put up for real cheap um yeah go check that out it's pretty cool so now i'm going to use this method um all-purpose spray to just kind of wash off the surface around the sink and i only have a little bit left but it is in lavender and here comes my husband to put more dishes in the sink and pickles what and ketchup okay and more loading of the dishes since he wanted to bring me more I'm using the Cascade, just little pods. And again, I'm just gonna wipe off the surfaces and the windows, get it all shining clean. 
You guys, it doesn't stay like this either. I literally have to do this every, what, two days? Sometimes more. So yeah, this little sponge thing, I got rid of it. It got on my nerves after a while. Now I'm just rearranging everything. Once again, sorry about the pumpkin decor, but hey, it may give you some ideas for next year. So I guess while I clean, I decided to just make myself a cup of coffee. I also want to show you guys a couple of things while I'm at it. Um, I got these containers from Costco and I really like them. It comes in all sizes. And I also like my sugar in the raw packets that I put in there as well. Um, I normally don't use the Dunkin Donuts creamer, but once again, Sorry, I had to um, pause for the breakdown. But um, anyway, yeah, my mom likes that creamer. So that's what I had. That's what I used. And this cup is from Five Below. I think it's super cute. I love it. Boop, boop. Do a little dance. Make a little love. Uh, by the way, I just got my new Smeg um, coffee machine. That I added to my addition, so I just was showing it off. It actually works really, really good. I like to put this rack under my toaster so that way, you know, I can clean it easier with all the crumbs. And I'm using this method um, granite spray. It works really good, it really shines your granite counters up. And just a microfiber cloth. So as you see, I kind of changed my coffee machine. The other one was a little big and I got this smaller one in blue. And now, actually, I ended up uh, spray painting it the same color as the other appliances. And I was going to show you guys and do a video and DIY it, but I didn't get to do that. So, my apologies. Um, I actually, I liked how it came out, but eh, I'm just going to buy a white one and just try not to be cheap when I can. So, yeah, but for now, it, it works. So now I'm just going to clean off the stove and um, yeah that kind of caught me off guard because I was showing you guys from the Dollar Tree the oven mitt um, but yeah sorry guys a little late for that but they do have all holiday oven mitts at the Dollar Tree so shout out to y'all. One of my pet peeves, guys, is a dirty stove. Like, I can't even clean, I'll clean stuff. I can't even cook if the stove is dirty. I literally have to clean the stove and then cook. Or if I like, I can't leave the house if the stove is dirty. I can't walk by the stove and it's dirty. I just, it has to shine. Who else is like that? Comment below.
so now I'm gonna clear off this island <clears throat> excuse me guys I don't know what's going on with my voice but this video is definitely not gonna be perfect this time <laughs> especially being late and all but whatever so yeah I'm just gonna put all this stuff away now also just to let you guys know um i'm still not sure about the music thing and what the rights are to the music i haven't looked into it yet so yeah i'm just gonna be playing the youtube music for now but in the background until i figure out exactly what the rights are or until i start um actually putting my own music in the background i'll figure it out guys i promise Now once again, I'm using my microfiber cloth and I'm just um, spraying with the Method Granite Spray, cleaning spray. Okay, and for my living room. First, let's get some light up in here. Open these windows. Literally between my dogs, my cats, or my kids, my pillows are usually always on the ground. Are all over the place. I really don't even know why I have them actually. I most definitely changed um, the furniture around in here as well now, but um, using this pledge and singing it and using it as a mic. But using this pledge to wipe down all the wood, this pledge wood cleaner, all the wood in the living room, and yep, once again, some cute little decor. <laughs> um, also, FYI, I got the pillows at Amazon, on Amazon, and actually, I did a whole video on um, fall decor, so yeah, go check that out. And for my little dining room, <laughs> that's what you call it. So yeah, as you all know, it's not the same because I put the shelves up. Once again, go watch my DIY video on farmhouse sh shelves. But yeah, um, and also in my little light thing that I was showing you guys there, um, there's a candle in it now. Everything's all different, but yeah. I'm just gonna wipe down these tables and these chairs with the pledge once again. And yep, shout out to Dollar Tree for these cute ornaments that I got for the uh, Christmas tree <laughs> and here I'm just going to vacuum my floors because my floors get disgusting I have a pool outside guys so I'm sure you can imagine the track the tracks of dirt mud and everything else that comes through my floors with all my pets and my kids on top of it, the floor's got a nerve to be white. I mean, well, off white. I really love this vacuum too, as well. 
Uh, maybe I'll put a link below on where you can get it. It's so light. It's just, I'm tiny, so it's very light and it gets the job done. It also fits in small surfaces and it has like other parts to it that you can attach to it. So you can clean out the car and small surfaces. You guys, my floors are real life dirty. So I like to mop my floors with boiling hot water. It's just a thing. I feel like it's not clean if it's not hot. So I get it hot in my smeg. Oh, my little heating kettle. <laughs> I love this thing, guys. It was actually the first smeg thing that I purchased, and it's just bomb. I also add a little Clorox bleach because I also feel like bleach cleans the floors really well. For me, it does at least. And I add an essential oil, which is, this one's the pumpkin pie, just because it was in season at the time and made the house smell really good and it kind of covered that bleach smell. This mop is the bomb. I've seen many women who use this um i watch a lot of cleaning channels so shout out to all of you ladies that are out there doing these cleaning motivation videos um it really inspired me to do them and i know i'm a beginner and i'm still learning <laughs> and um, i have so much to show you guys and so much more that i do but i'm um a really busy mom so i you know i own a dog business as mo most of you know <clears throat> me and my husband so we have pretty chaotic and busy lives so when I'm able to do this and when I'm able to record or when I'm able to remember um yeah I love doing them so please subscribe and like and you know just show your love and support I actually have a huge support system on my Instagram so I will leave a link below to my Instagram if you want to follow there as well I do live stories all the time um, I'm up there all the time so shout out to my Instagram I'll leave a link below and here I'm just cleaning out my pool area and testing the water which is probably cold There's so much I want to do back here still, like get some outside, you know, rugs and things like that. Um, it actually looks a little different than it does now. Um, because of the holidays, I fixed it up a little more. I actually mounted my TV outside and things like that, so. New video will be coming soon after this, but I didn't want to leave this one behind, so I decided to just post it anyway. using this glass cleaner that I got at the Dollar Tree to be honest with you and I'm just wiping off this glass top this is like a little bar <coughs> and normally the wine goes underneath it has a little wine holder but I have a fridge outside so I keep it cool in the fridge <coughs> And I really, really, really appreciate you guys watching and I just appreciate the love. Um, once again, please subscribe, please like. I need all the love I can get right now. And um, thanks guys. Love ya.